Good morning, guys. Okay, I'm actually running a little late. I was on time, but now I'm late because my phone just won't charge and I can't figure out why it's not charging. But I turned it on, turned it off, didn't work in the car. I went in the house, tried it again, didn't work. And then I turned it off, left it for like a minute or two, turned it back on and it works in the wall. So I'm gonna bring this because I know this works. Um, now we're gonna see if it actually works in the car. So let's turn the car on. I'm hoping that it's not like an actual, whoo, an actual problem so that I can just kind of, um, here I'm plugging it in. Um, so I just don't have to, I don't know. I don't know if it's charging because I'm recording, but um, I'll let you guys know what's going on with my phone. Okay, so it is charging. I think it was just like a glitch or something. We'll see how it goes for the rest of the day. But I woke up this morning and it was actually completely dark outside. Like the moon was out and everything. So that means fall has started and I'm super excited because this is like my favorite time of the year other than spring going into summer. But now I like it because I get to be comfy cozy under all the blankets and sweaters and um, I start to get put all the spices out. I mean pumpkin spice, yeah, but it's more like the cinnamons, like those kind of smells I really like. So we're gonna start putting those out soon. I have to go pick up some candles, hopefully in the next couple of weeks, just start putting them around the house, just get it nice and cozy in the house. And that's my favorite time of year is like fall and like winter Christmas time because it's just, you just feel the presence of home. Like I can't explain it other than that. Um, Whereas spring and summer are just kind of like fun and like, you know, tan and sun and shine and everything. But I just like the homing feeling and we should be going home for Christmas this year. We should be. We'll see. I'm not yet sure exactly what's going on with that, but I'm hoping we can get home for Christmas this year. We're, we're planning for it. So, but let's get through fall first and Halloween and all that fun stuff. Good morning, guys. It is actually a kind of gloomy uh, muggy kind of day. Uh, can't really see it because it's bright, but it's all foggy out right now. Uh, the kids have eaten breakfast. Nicole just left for work. Nico is dancing to Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. And we've had a problem with the kids trying to get into the hallway closet, which has the dog food in it and everything like that. So I have installed child safety locks. Yay. <laughs> uh, other than that, uh, not much going on right now. Um, yeah, good morning. So here's the reaction to the lock. Here's the reaction to the lock so far. They are not fans. You don't like the lock? What's wrong with the lock? Oh, you're mad. Cold. You're cold? Okay. Nico doesn't like the lock. Ariana doesn't like the lock. But Daddy and Mommy? We love the lock. <laughs> okay, so we just finished having lunch, but this one over here has been bad all all morning. I cannot figure out he won't take a nap. I've tried giving him a nap. I've given him a snack. Like I've given him everything. I've given him cuddles. I'm holding him, all that stuff. But the moment just just crying all day. So it's gonna be one of those days, right? Do you wanna sit down? You wanna sit down? No? <sighs> Alright. Well, today will be a fun day. <laughs> okay guys, so I figured it out. We are teething our back molars. So there is nothing I can do other... I've given him teething gel, but there's nothing I can do for him at this point. He's sadly... Nico, hey, it's just one of those things that you have to go through in life. There is nothing I can do for you. It's something we all have to go through. It's gonna hurt, okay? I know it's gonna hurt, but you know, as soon as it's done, you'll feel much better. Well, it's a teething day. Okay, so second update on teething. We are a little bit better. We've got some teething tablets in him. He's taking his nap. He's a little bit better. He's still cranky. But I'm trying to keep him occupied, right? Say, your brother, eh, put your shirt up. Say, say, ni say Nico's teething. Me 
tiger in my teeth. Yep. And that is basically all we were trying to do. We were trying to succeed in keeping this one as happy as possible during the teething. Mm -mm, mm -mm. He said no. Nicole's about to walk into the door and I'm going to record the reaction. And the one who's freaking out the most is him. So it is dinner time and I made the kids and myself uh, some hot dogs and I gave the kids some french fries. Nico, is it good? Is it good? Good. Yeah? I love fries. French fries and, and hot dog. And fries. And fries. And yeah, so that is what we're eating for dinner. Okay, I know it's dark, but I am locking up shop, locking the door, making sure nobody can get in, just close the sliding glass door, and just cleaning up around the house. I just sneezed, so my eyes are all watery. And look what Dom went and got me. He got me a blizzard. It was so sweet. He got me an Oreo Royal Blizzard. I only eat like usually a half or a quarter of it. I ate a half this time. Uh, and then I'll eat like the rest of it tomorrow. But I am ready for bed. My face is clean. Brushed my hair. The kids going to bed was kind of a nightmare. Uh, Ariana just wanted story after story after story after story and I'm, I probably would still be reading her stories right now if she had it her way. So I think after like the 10th book, I'm not even exaggerating, the 10th book, I was finally like, no, you need to lay down, you need to go to bed. So she was screaming and didn't want to go to sleep and so Nico was up screaming and I gave him more um, teething tablets to help him with his teeth, the poor little man, he's getting his molars in. Um, so. Yeah, finally they both went to sleep is what I'm trying to say. And now I'm going to go to sleep. So remember to like and subscribe down below and we'll see you tomorrow. Oh, that's something I almost forgot. If we get to 140 subscribers, I think I said by next week. I can't remember. I said it on my Twitter. I can't remember the exact day. I'll have to go check. We will do a Q&A um, with you guys. So we'll definitely do that if we hit 140 subscribers i think i said by next week like monday next week i think that's what i said i can't remember um and also follow us on snapchat because uh it's actually my snapchat and i put a bunch of stuff there up there all day usually it's more active on the weekends because i can't really record things at work but if for some reason i'm not vlogging something um Usually it'll be posted up there. So make sure you're checking those out as well. So we'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Do that do, do, do. Yes, I am home and the doggies are out playing. Thank you, Zim. The world wants to 